Danny, I mean, uh, slightly overdue, welcome to Gateshead, obviously coming in on, on Saturday just before the, the Aldershot game, but coming in today, I suppose, first training session with the, the rest of the boys, I mean, how have you settled in and, and how have you found things this morning? Uh, fairly well. Um, I've enjoyed obviously being around the boys. I didn't know any of them before, really. Um, we've got a lot of kind of mutual friends and stuff, having played at Hartlepool before and also having a few old teammates that have played at Gateshead previously. So connected with the boys really easily and found it really enjoyable so far. I mean, you mentioned there not knowing anyone, I suppose. Is that sometimes a bit difficult for a player when you know, you're know you coming into a, a dressing room on, I suppose, a bit of a clean slate where there isn't a familiar face to kind of latch onto straight away or, or do you not really find it too difficult? Uh, not really too difficult. Um, I've had a lot of new teams before. You know, I've played against Gateshead a few times. Um, so I know of a lot of the players and I believe some of them know of me as well. So. It's been fairly easy and you know they've all, all been really welcoming to me as well. Yeah, and in terms of obviously joining on on loan from, from Bournemouth for the rest of the season, I mean, what sort of factors went into the, the decision to, to make the, the trip up north? Um, I wanted more game time and I thought it would be a great opportunity. I know obviously playing in the same league as Bournemouth, um, I believe I'm capable of scoring goals at this level. Played against Gateshead a lot of times, so I know they play fantastic football, which I'm looking forward to hopefully being involved in um, and I know they've got a lot of good players so it was a great opportunity you know I knew there was interest from their side as well and as I say I wanted more game time so um, I wanted to take the opportunity. Yeah, You mentioned this was the interest from, from our side as well obviously Mike and, and Buster had, had tried to, to get you over the summer but I suppose does that make it nice in a way that you know you're coming somewhere where you know there's been previous interest from the management side and that they know that they feel like you would fit into the side? Yeah, definitely. Like I say, going to a new team, you know, the more game time isn't necessarily guaranteed, but knowing that the coaching staff here are um, fans of mine um, and, and like the way I play and um, have wanted me here for a while, it um, definitely makes things a lot easier and makes me feel confident coming into the club, you know, being given the number nine and being told um, that I think I can do well here. Um, it definitely gives me confidence and um, makes me excited to start playing games. Obviously, you mentioned playing against Gateshead sides recently, obviously with Boston last season and, and Boreham Wood here already this season. But in terms of you know when you've been a player preparing to sort of go against a Gateshead side that, that Mike and Buster have been in charge of, I mean, what have sort of been the the main points or, or what you've been expecting to, to come up against, I suppose, when you're playing against Gateshead? Uh, they press really aggressively. Um, keep the ball really well, you know, they play out, um, a lot of players wanting the ball, moving it really well and just playing really attractive football and scoring a lot of goals. You know, last year scored a lot of goals, um, had some high scoring players in the team um, and I know they create a lot of chances so I'm hoping that we can replicate that and um, I can score some goals for the club. Yeah, and you mentioned a little earlier in, in terms of obviously coming in and trying to get more regular game time, but I mean, just how do you feel personally in, in, in terms of match fitness and, and things like that? Obviously, game time has been a little more on the limited side at Boreham Wood so far this season, but coming on for, for your debut in the, the second half on Saturday, how do you just feel personally coming in? Um, I feel fit, sharp, ready to go. Um, you know, still obviously looking after myself and being full time for the last few months and obviously still featuring in a lot of games. I feel ready to go, you know, I'm excited for Notts County next week and looking forward to um, hopefully making my mark on the club. You mentioned Notts County next up without a game this weekend, of course, with the Dagenham fixture being postponed. So I suppose you've got a longer period of, of training to kind of settle in and acclimatise and things like that. But are you looking at that, I suppose, as a positive, having a bit more time on the training pitch than you normally would before you go into a game next Tuesday? Yeah, I think it's a bit of a blessing in disguise, really, because it just gives me an opportunity to get to know the lads a little bit more and, um, you know, get used to the way we play, um, know everyone's name and that kind of thing. So um, it gives me a little bit longer to um, get relaxed and settle in, really. Yeah, and I suppose in terms of former clubs, really, obviously, when the, when the news went out on, on Saturday that you'd joined for the rest of the season, Boston fans and, and Hartlepool fans in particular were both pretty complimentary of you. And I mean, I suppose for you as a player, is that nice knowing that, you know, you, you've been at clubs, made an impact and that fans still speak highly of you after you've left? No, definitely, definitely. You know, I only had the one season at Boston, had a shorter time than that at Hartlepool, but had some success as a team at Hartlepool and had some success as a team at Boston as well. You know, I had probably my best season um, at Boston um, personally, um, and I'm glad that the fans obviously speak highly of me afterwards as well. 
and obviously coming in sort of nearing the halfway point of the season now but how are you personally just looking to to make an impact obviously going through a, a bit of a rough period results wise at the minute but how are you looking to I suppose slot into things and, and help turn things around um, you know doing what I do best um, hopefully scoring some goals um, stretching teams running at people taking shots on being exciting personally obviously being confident scoring goals getting back to playing my best football and obviously as a team um, getting out of the relegation zone you know climbing up the league and, and solidifying a place in this league where Gateshead should be really yeah and you mentioned obviously before not away specifically coming up next Tuesday you've already scored against them this season for Boreham Wood and I suppose in the grander scheme things not a huge amount of trickier games going not away at the minute but I mean how do you feel the the approach needs to be for that one next week uh, I think the boys especially from speaking to them this morning are going to react really well you know, obviously it was hurting everybody to lose on the weekend and I think there'll be a big reaction from the boys. For me personally, I'm really excited. You know, I live around the corner from Notts County Stadium um, back in Nottingham. So it's a stadium I've always wanted to play in, never played in. Um, maybe I actually did play in it as a child in a school game, but not as an adult. Um, so I'm really looking forward to that, um, having that opportunity. And as I say, I think the boys are going to react really well. And, and, you know, we spoke this morning about trying to graph for every point that we need to get. Um, and I think they're definitely going to be doing that.